Hi guys, today I'm coming to you with my latest tag video. Now if you see the name of this tag video, or it's down there somewhere, and it's going to be the colors of the rainbow tag. I have already done this tag, but I was recently approached by my friend Beauty by Crystal who said if I wanted to go ahead and do a collab video, and we're going to put a little twist on the colors of the rainbow tag, we're only going to be using lippies and nail polishes. And that's a little challenging considering I don't have, say, like a woo lipstick or anything like that, so it was a little challenging. So if you guys want to see how I did, just keep on okay, watching. Okay, so I will be doing this tag with several other ladies here on YouTube. I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys know the names of them so you can check them all out in the description box but also at the end of the video so you guys can have time to jot it down and stuff like that. So let me go ahead and get started. The first color in the tag is the shade red. Now I don't really wear red nail polishes but I do have one red and I really like it and that is Velvet Rope by Revlon Color Stay and I love this line of nail polishes and it looks like this. Sorry it's really bright. It's really hot today outside if you guys can see that. And it's so pretty because it's like a deeper red. So I really love that. And to go with that, I, I love other reds. I love the Rimmel. I think it's 109 or something like that. It's more of a deep red, but I can't find them. I have no clue where it went. So I went ahead and I picked another favorite. This is kind of a red slash berry color. And that is Raspberry Bite by Revlon. And it looks like this. And I absolutely love it. It's so, so beautiful. It's deep, but it comes off bright. You guys have probably seen this in another video of mine. And the next shade is orange. And now I really love certain kinds of orange. The, my favorite orange is actually from Models Own, and it's the shade Fuzzy Peach. And it's so, so pretty. I try not to use all model, Models Own shades because I know they're harder to get, and it's expensive for shipping and stuff like that from the UK. But, oh, I absolutely love this. If I can, oh, get it out of the sunlight for you guys. Maybe that'll help you guys see it. Like It's got, like, slight little sparkles in it. It's so, so pretty. It's one of my favorite orange shades. And to go with that, I compared all my peachy slash orange lip products, and I actually found one of my like most potent orange shades, and that's going to be number 12 from the Rimmel Kate line. And you guys probably all know what this looks like. It's so deep and red in orange. I'm sorry. All my other ones lean more towards peach. This one leans strictly more towards orange. This and Revlon Rondi, which I showed in my previous Colors of the Rainbow tag video. So I really, really like this one. I did have it on earlier, but I actually took it off and switched it for the shade I have on now. And this is going to be my only repeat, and it's for the color yellow, and that's because I only own one yellow nail polish. Don't own a yellow lipstick, obviously. And it's going to be Models Own Lemon Meringue. My Holy Grail Yellow Nail Polish, because it's like a pastel yellow, and it goes any time of the year. It's like a lemony yellow, but like toned down. So I really, really like that. The next shade is one of my favorites. Now, if you guys know me, I was born in May. My favorite shade is green. My birthstone is an emerald, stuff like that. So my favorite, so green's easy for me. So my favorite green nail polish actually is Posh from Revlon. And I almost forgot about this shade because it was back in my storage area and I completely forgot that I had it. And I had to pull out all my, you know, lipsticks and nail polishes to try it and do this tag differently. So I, when I saw this, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to wear this next. So when I change my nails, this is probably what's going on afterwards. And I absolutely love this. It's so, so pretty. And such a perfect cream green shade. And my next favorite. Now I do have quite a few blues, but they're always like slightly off your normal blue shade. But my favorite light blue is from China Glaze and that is Bohemian Escape, which I have loved for years. And it just looks so good. It looks lighter in the bottle than actually appears like on your toes or your fingers. But I really love this. If you guys can still get it, I'm pretty sure it's still available. Um, check this out because it's a very beautiful blue. Okay, and my next shade is Indigo, and I actually have one Indigo nail polish. I was really surprised. And that is from, uh, I think it's Shriver, Shriver, Shearer? I think that's how you say it. I don't know. And it's a chameleon nail polish in the shade Blue Sky. And it does. It's a duochrome that goes from blue to purple, so it's, like, perfect in between. So I don't know if you guys can see that, if the light will help or not. So I do like this one. It does take a couple coats. I usually just use this over the top of, like, a blue nail polish just to give it some sheen on the top, so I really like that. And the next shade is Violet. Now, I only have one sort of more true violet shade, and that is from Julie G's nail polish line, and it's Royal Rebel. And I love this shade because it is just like a true velvet, but I like that there's kind of a, two tones to it. It's not just one toned nail polish. It's very, very pretty. And if you guys are wondering what's on my nails, it's um, Danny from Zoya. So I really like that one too, but I love this one especially. And that one does have a lippy. For the purples, I do have a lippy. It's the one I'm wearing now, and I absolutely love it. And it's from Revlon. It's the Revlon Super Lustrous line, and it's very hot. And it looks like this. It's one of my favorite purple shades. I've loved this for, like, three or four years. It's so, so, so pretty. 
it's beautiful and I would probably always repurchase it. I don't want to blind you guys. The sun is just like all up in my face right now. But I absolutely love it. Let me swatch it for you guys. And it looks like that. And it's also on my lips. So I really recommend this one. And then pink. Now, for me, I don't like bright pinks. Like, I do, but I kind of don't. I really like right now during this time of year, I kind of like to wear soft pinks. And one of my favorites is Starfish from Sinful Colors. Because it's kind of like a soft pink, but not so soft that it, like, melds into your skin, you know? So I really love this one and really recommend this one. Now, I don't know if this is limited edition. I want to say it was. If it was, bummer for me. That sucks. And then for my lippy, I love love the Revlon lip butters but I like lollipop that's one of my favorites because it doesn't take much to bump up your lips and I love the glossy finish on it because it doesn't dry out my lips which during summer my lips can get dry I have to be really careful so I really really like this one because it gives me the color and I don't have to worry about it like blending bleeding into like my lines of my lips or anything like that so I really really love that one Okay, and then the funner shades are, for the first one is multicolored. That was more under the fun shades. And for me, my favorite glitter from the drugstore is Strobe Light from Sally Hansen. And I absolutely love this. I love this just to do accent nails and stuff like that. I don't think I've ever worn it just strictly on its own. But it's so, so pretty because it does totally fit into that multicolor. But I like that it has more of like a pinky glitter base. I really enjoy that one. So that's really pretty. And then the last two colors are black and white. And my favorite black nail polish, because I don't really wear black that often, is from Revlon and it's black lingerie. And that's because it takes like two thin coats and it stays on and it doesn't really chip that much or anything like that. And it lasts well because my nails really rub off on the tips more than anything. And this one doesn't do it that bad. And I really love the, um, the Color Stay base coat. That's one of my favorite base coats ever. And with the Revlon nail polishes, it just makes it last even longer. So I love black lingerie for black. And then for white, I actually only own one white nail polish, and that is Milani's Nail Lacquer in White. And I do like this one. I think I've worn it like four or five times the whole time I've had it, because if I use it, I only use it like as a base. I don't think I've ever just painted my nails white. I don't know. Or I use it just to dot on my nails. So I do really like that one. Milani does have good nail polish. So in this collaboration, there's going to be six of us total, I believe, six or seven of us doing this. And I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys their names, but I will list them below so you guys can check them out. The first and foremost is Beauty by Crystal. She's a great blogger. She makes me look like freshman status when it comes to taking pictures and blogging because her pictures are like amazing. And then there's Destiny 146, Bold Beautiful Makeup. I will put it, like I said, below. I think it's Bold and Beautiful Makeup. Am I wrong? And then there's Gloss and Glitz. And then I think her page is Confidence is Beauty. I think that's her name. And then Official Sanity. I think I got them all. Yeah. And we're all going to be doing this collab. Like I said, I'm going to link them below so you guys can go and find them. And I hope you guys check out their channels. And I hope you guys like this little twist we went ahead and did on the Colors of the Rainbow tag. And I hope you enjoy it. And I'll talk to you next time.